Alright everyone, this is Zero Budget Geek and welcome back to Pathfinder Adventures Rise of the Rune Lords. Hey guys, so we are moving on to the next uh, adventure here, or rather scenario. Gotta be careful about saying that because adventure is burnt offerings and we're doing a different scenario. So last time we did attack on Sandpoint, which we defeated, and now we have local heroes. Um, this one should be interesting because there is no villain, uh, but there our henchmen which is the henchman is actually one random ally per location during this scenario if you acquire an ally you may immediately attempt to close your location if you fail the check to acquire an ally discard the top card of the blessings deck to win this scenario close all locations so we gotta do all six locations there's no main villain to defeat but the purpose of this scenario is really to try to get as many cards as possible to stock our decks but we gotta balance that with you know gaining cards but also closing locations so let's just uh and then uh, when we defeat this we'll each receive a random ally and that'll be it so let's go ahead and start and uh welcome back my friends or should i now call you heroes of standpoint like everyone else does Though local fame is not my ambition, it may bolster my prospects of becoming a member of the Pathfinder Society. Well, Eltren, I'm delighted that you are here. Please, I wish to know everything about you. What does it take to be a hero like you? This may be a good time to get out into town, get to, get to know some other people. Under the circumstances, I will heed your advice. Alright. All right, so let's take a look at what we got here. We got the general store. We know this place during your exploration. If you encounter anything other than armor, item, weapon, you may explore again. So that's a good one to probably start off with. Um, and it's banish a card to close it. We've got the academy here on the first exploration of your turn. If you encounter anything other than a spell after the exploration, you may immediately explore again. Succeed in an intelligence or arcane six check to close it. Um, that's good for the wizard. Uh, here we have the rusty dragon. If you fail to check to acquire an ally you may put that ally on the bottom of your, the location deck charisma diplomacy six to close this that'll be uh the fighter you may want to go there early with him to try to get a good chance at closing that we have the waterfront um summon and defeat a bandit henchman to close it that's pretty easy to do so we could actually save that for later and maybe the wizard will go there because anybody using weapons it has a penalty there so that's probably for the wizard we have the sandpoint cathedral banish either a blessing or Father Xanthus, that's definitely the cleric. I think I want to do that with her sooner than later. And in the woods, succeed at a wisdom or survival six check. Um, hmm. Well, that would definitely be the cleric. Uh, the question is, I think I want her to go to Sandpoint Cathedral first. So she'll go there. Um, I think I want the fighter to try to close off the Rusty Dragon. The Academy... The wizard will go there and banish a card. This one's easy. This was not easy. So we'll go to the we'll go to the general store with the rogue there. She likes items anyway. All right, I think that's good. So I think our uh, I like this. The turn order is fine. So we're back at Sandpoint. I think for this scenario, we wanna close. We want to close them early if we can. So we're going to try to give up, you know, on um, early gains uh, in order to later on when we have lots of turns left to uh, then be able to finish things off. All right. We got a show pole here. It is 100% chance of acquiring it. So I will do that. And Blessing of Calastria is non-combat dexterity, which I don't really need. So I'm going to discard it to go again. A leather armor. 83% uh, chance. We'll just roll that straight up. We get it. That's not terrible to have. Um, I can use the Staff of Minor Healing. Why not? Might as well use this now. Recharge this. That'll get me that Blessing back. Plus the uh, Staff goes to the bottom of my deck. We have five cards here. I think I want to use one of these. Melee, Fortitude, Range, Stealth, or Craft. 
Um, I think I want to keep this because that might be useful towards acquiring an ally. How many allies we have here? There's two plus an extra one, I think, right? No, just two allies. Um, yeah, let's use this. Go again. We want to burn through these as soon as possible. 100% chance to get a silent enforcer. I've never seen this card. Uh, recharge this card to add 1d10 and the melee trait to your combat check. It, you may not play a spell that has the attack trait or a weapon on this check. Recharge this card to add 1d10 to your stealth check. That's interesting. All right, it's 100% chance to get it. We could discard it to explore. But I think here we're gonna go ahead and just close the explore, uh, close this location. Yes, and we'll banish this leather armor since we just got that. Banish, and that's closed. Excellent, that's good. Um, when these, uh, oh, this is cool. We get five items will appear here, and I will acquire one for free. I forget, I always forget about that. So we got a one of force missile. I could explore now, but no, I can because there's a I think potion of hiding. I don't really care about that. So we'll roll if we get it. Great. If not, uh, we're not gonna spend the silent enforcer potion of hiding. Although, yeah, I can't really play any of these for anything. So I'm gonna have to discard a card here, and I guess the potion of hiding. And that'll be it. We'll end the turn there. Alright, the fighter here wants to close this off. Alright, let's see. Goblin War Chanter. Before you play a spell that has the attack or what? Succeed Wisdom A check, or you may not play spells that have the attack or. Ooh, or. Ooh. Okay. So, before I can do this. Alright, what am I doing? Combat. I could just, I have an 80% chance just to beat him with my hands, but I might as well reveal this and try anyway. Succeed a wisdom check. <laughs> so I can't do it. Oh, that sucks. All right, so I gotta fight him hand to hand. Wow, that's, actually I could've, I, I didn't even look at what everybody else had. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot here. Oh, we can, we have this orb of frost. Um. That'll really increase it, and there's a chance that I can... Oh, we got this. I will reveal this. Give me a 90% chance. Alright, I think I'm gonna roll this, because if I fail it, I, I still ha I have this chamber that can protect me, so we'll roll it straight up. And there we go. Defeated. Um, I could discard it to explore my location. I think I want to do that. We, we need to burn through these locations as fast as possible, so we'll do that. Mayor, oh god. Banish this. Charisma Diplomacy of 10. I have a 0% chance. This... Um, doesn't help. What's this do? This for Constitution. I mean, I could. Non-combat wisdom doesn't help. So I could blessing the gods. I could get, um, I could get three d six. That's uh, three, six, nine, ten, eleven average. It's still slightly better than fifty percent chance. So. Where are we at? There's four, there's four more allies, so I'm not gonna burn resources trying to get this one. There's three other allies, sorry. So, we're just gonna say sorry. She requires too much diplomacy. Move ally to the bottom of the, oh, we can do that. That's good. All right, uh, pass the turn. So we get another chance at that, if we really need to. All right, we'll explore here. A mending spell, 100% chance to acquire it. Sure. Um, let's explore now. Uh, Goblin Warrior. 
Oh, I can reveal this to give me a plus one. Oof. Uh, lightning touch, I guess. Makes it a 99% chance, so no need to spend anything else. We'll roll that straight up. Zap him away. I'll go ahead and recharge the spell. 91% chance. I'll go for it like that. And we'll expand the spell book. And I get my detect magic. I'll draw that. And I will play the detect magic. Let's play that. This is a jelly spell. I will encounter that. Recharge the detect magic. 100% chance. Oh. And let's do my expanded spell book. Lightning touch. I will draw that. Um, although I should have not drawn it. I should have not drawn it. Because now I have to discard a card. Alright, we get that. Agility. Really doesn't help me. I could goblin. I could do this to go again. But it's just gonna basically banish the next thing. Which might be an ally, so kinda don't wanna do that. So I think we're just gonna go ahead and end the turn. I could just play agility, right? I could just display this. Uh next to me. Whatever. I have plus three. One, two, three, four, five, six. I have seven cards. Um, because I don't want to discard cards, so I might as well just play what I can, because I can play these basically for free. And then at the end of the turn, I have a chance of recharging them. So it's better than discarding them. All right, so recharge. We got a 75% chance. Failed. Um... Go for the recharge of the flare burst. Failed. Oh my god, what the hell. And it doesn't matter if we do expanded spell buff. Actually, I should not have done that. I'm an idiot. We're not going to draw that. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm not going to draw that. All right. It's fine. It's fine. I never said I'm an expert player. I said I just... I'm an enthusiastic player. Let's explore the Sandpoint Cathedral. Oh, one of the worst creatures in the game. Fortunately, um, I have good wisdom. So, she, this combat is a wisdom check. All damage dealt by the Siren is mental damage that may not be reduced. If undefeated, examine the top three cards of your deck and discard any allies. Shuffle. Yeah, she's just bad. Horrible card. But a blessing of Shaylin is to non-combat wisdom, which I think this is, right? It is. So 99% chance to succeed. Uh, anything I can play for free? No. So we'll just roll. Yes. I hate the freaking siren. It's so horrible. So horrible. Um, I'm not going to use this Blessing of the Gods because we need this to close this location. So we're going to just pass the turn. And we're not going to explore here. What are we going to go next with the rogue? Uh, we could go to the woods. But my wisdom isn't good. Well, actually, yes, it is. It's a D8. Why didn't I think I... Why did I think my wisdom was not good? Oh, wow. We we have a good chance at it. All right. We'll go to the woods with the... Uh, with the rogue. So, boop and boop. All right. So, simply explore. Ocean of energy resists. I don't care about that. So, we'll just roll it straight up. Don't get it. That's fine. Um, Silent Enforcer. I think I'm just going to discard it to go again. Mercenary. I can want to force missiles. Uh, after you may succeed. This is not bad for the... Um, for the wizard, because he can he can recharge this instead of burying. If I bury that, I'm not gonna give it to the. I, I doubt I'm gonna have time to give it to the wizard. If I bury this, it's only 41 percent chance. That's not really that good. Uh, so I think we just uh, review my short bow. 62 percent chance is not great. 
Um, I can use that frost orb. Why is my combat so shitty? I kind of think I want to keep keep that. Let's uh orb of frost. Display it. Puts me at eighty one percent chance. Oh, what am I thinking? I could uh hold on. Cancel these things. Review. Let's backstab here. We'll recharge this one of force missiles. That gives me a ninety six percent chance without having to use up other cards. I mean, that was close though. Alright, I don't think I'm spending that to go again. I may need Oh shit, it's still I didn't cancel that. 50% chance. No. Nope. I screwed up there. I, I thought I canceled the Orb of Frost. Oh, well. It still worked out. I mean, we needed to defeat that thing, so. Alright. Vermilion Rhomboid. Review this card to add 1d10 to your non-combat acrobatics. You may play another item on this check. You may recharge this card when you reset your hand. Eh. Not really interested, but we do get it. So, that's interesting. Um... Maybe you charge this card when you reset your hand. Let's do that. Recharge that. Not gonna discard anything else. Alright, wizard. What are you doing? Looking in here, a frost ray. Has a 91% chance to get it. And I fail. That's a that was a good spell that I missed. I should have I should have done something there. Alright, well, not much else we can do here. I'm not going to use the golem, so pass the turn. We are burning through turns, though, here. Um, detect evil. I'm not going to do that yet. We'll explore first. Improved guidance. Discard this card to add three to any check. Oh, shit. After playing this card, if you do not... This is a 100% chance. This is nice. Holy shit, that's pretty good. Three to any check is not bad at all. Um, let's go detect evil. There's only one bad guy in here, but we might as well cast a card. Yeah, let's do that. Boop. There's a blessing up next. Does it leave it on top? It does. Alright, let's go ahead and recharge that. 90% chance. I could have improved guidance, but we'll hold on to that. We're going to need that improved guidance for uh, these uh, checks we got to do to acquire people. Okay, I'm not doing anything. I could cure, but that seems like a waste right now. So we're going to have to just pass the turn. We need to really burn through these decks, though. I feel like I'm not moving fast enough. This is not good. I'm not going to be able to defeat this. Damn it. Damn it. Well, since I cannot defeat it. Oh, wait. Undefeated monsters other than villains or henchmen are banished. So, this should go away regardless. So, we'll reveal this. I will do a backstab. I'm going to recharge this. It's only a 74% chance. Damn. Prove guidance. I don't think I want to do that. Um... If I fail, this would be bad, though. But what's my average here? I know it's 74%, but I have 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, and a half is my average. So I kind of feel good about this. But if I don't, if I don't, I'm not losing a terrible amount. So we'll go like that. And there you go. He's defeated, but... Because of this location, he's considered defeated, so very good. Pass the turn. Dig in here. Ven Vender, I gotta get this guy. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, because whenever we, we acquire an ally, we can uh, attempt to close. So, 50% chance. It's Charisma, Diplomacy, or Dexterity, Stealth. Stealth. But then his... That makes it a default. Let's see here. Melee of Fortitude. Improved Guidance. 
Let's see if I use this. It's it's fifty percent chance, which d d that did not make it better. That sucks. If I do this, goes up to ninety one percent chance. I think I'm okay with that. Close the location. Yes, I have a fifty percent chance. Um. I think we're going to use Guidance here. Makes it 100. Yeah. We need to close it, so... I need to make sure of that. We're burning through towns. Uh, and closing recharge an ally from your discard pile. Right, we'll do that. I don't think we have a... We do have an ally. Yes. Alright, yes. And we'll attempt to recharge and put Guidance. I have a 100% chance. I think I'm going to keep that in my deck. That's a nice spell. Improved guidance. All right. Uh, Vin Vendor banishes to join I uh, to join a new item. Ah, uh, we don't know about that. But we would have to discard right now. So might as well just banish him so, instead of having to discard. Oh, but I'm gonna have to discard anyway. Holy water. Well, I still have to discard. So, we'll discard the holy water. No optional discards. Alright, that's it. So, we're done there. We closed two places. Um, but that is not good. It took us 12 turns to close. Only two. Yeah, only two places. That's not... No bueno. Alright. Soldier. I need to get him. I need to get him. If I use this, makes a 72% chance. I really don't want to spend that blessing of the gods. Discard this. 72% chance. He's the last ally here. I have to do this. But then, wait a minute. What am I th thinking? No, there is actually one other ally here. So if we fail here, we're going to roll it. No, you bastard. You bastard. All right, there is another one. We'll get to explore again. Secret stash. Wisdom perception. We can't make it right now, but we got a thief's tools. And this is the only barrier here, so we'll discard this to defeat that. Um, if undefeated, you may banish this barrier. Uh, wait. Examine the top three cards of your location deck. If you find a weapon, an item, or a blessing, shuffle one of those into your deck. Put the remaining cards on top of the location deck in any order. That is quite good. We'll attempt to recharge these thieves tools, but we're gonna fail, I think, yeah. That's okay. It, it did what it needed to do. I hate, I, I really hate this scenario. It is, it's pretty tough. Um, I like this guy. Intelligence Arcane, we want him. We want him over here. And we don't care about everything else. Alright. So, and that. Mending? We can discard this. I. Uh, to discard a weapon, an armor, or an item that pledges a card of that type from his discard pile. Um, I'm kind of tempted to do it. J I can get the thieves' tools back. I think I want to do that. Mending is the. Oh, it's actually arcane. Alright. Oh. Confirm this action. Yeah. Although, this is reusable. Oh well, we, we committed to it. That ended up not being a good idea. That ended up not being really being a good idea. And let's recharge the building. That's fine. Expand, expand this spell book. We get an augury. Uh, I'm not going to use that right now. We'll draw it. We're going to end our turn. I definitely want to get that that dude over there. All right, what do we got here? 
Not much we can do. Oh, we can look at this. It's a blessing, which we should be able to get. And then hopefully, hopefully we'll get 100%. So we'll get this and we'll go ahead and use it. We'll, we'll use this to go again. Night watch. I want this. 60% chance. Oh, does anybody have anything to help me? They do not. So I gotta hope. There, there are still two more allies. No, one more ally, I think. Because I think this is counting him. <sighs> oh. Let's hope. Got him. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Close location, yes. Banish this. And it is done. Alright, cool. Believe it or not, this is a tough tough uh, scenario. I think I'm going to go get these blessings back. Get those blessings back. I think we're going to really need them. We recharge the cure. 70% chance. And I get it. Good, good. Alright. And that's why I, I, I upgrade the stat that they're already good at because I want them to just be excellent at that one, their one thing. Um, so that when those situations come up, we, we're nearly sure it's going to work out. All right, we'll explore here. Uh, scimitar is not super useful. So, we don't, don't care about it. I'm fine with that going away. I want it to go away. I don't have anything to let me go again, so we'll just pass the turn. Holy Candle is actually kind of nice. That will be helpful. All right, we need to send the fighter somewhere. I don't think I want him to go to the waterfront. Because the waterfront is kind of bad for him. And there's lots of fighting over there. Um, I actually think... Let me see something. I actually think I'm going to go with the fighter to the woods. And help out. Yeah, because that's a wisdom. Alright, we'll go with the fighter to the woods. Help out the rogue. Because the fighter is one of the few people that the rogue doesn't mind being uh, with out of location. Because even though she can't use her backstab, the fighter gives her, at least still gives her a die. Uh, there's, what's better, a great club or a battle axe? D6 plus one. That's a D10. Wow. But we can discard this, right? So 99% chance. Crush him or chop him in half. Recharge the battle axe. And that's it. Alright, that's the turn. And the wizard will explore here. Alright, I have an 83% chance. I do not want to fail this. I do not want to fail this. So, a blessing on a check. Wait, place a spell on a check. That's not what's going on here. Melee fortitude. Um, I think I'll just discard this. 99% chance. I'm good with that. Close the location. Yes. 91% chance. I, I, I don't think I want to... I, I don't think I want to risk it. Let's make it 100%. 100%. I am not screwing around. Because this this uh, this scenario really sucks. Uh, you may shuffle a spell from your disc up onto your deck. Sure. Um, flare Burst. I don't care about agility. Alright. We got to discard cards. Um, no, damn it. We just got to discard one. Um, during turn, review this card. Uh, put on top of your deck. Examine the top of the deck. After you play this card, roll. Hmm. Read this card on top of you. Okay. I mean that 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 guy is so interesting. Um. Hmm. So, what do we discard here? I think we we're, we're gonna discard the the golem. And that's it. I kind of like it sorely. Alright, so here we need to move with the cleric somewhere. And I think... So what do we have open? 
We only have two locations open. Twelve turns. Got the waterfront. Um, I think I'm gonna come with the cl come over here and just help them drill down on this location here. Oh, damn it! So, skeleton or each character at an open location. Some is in encounters and ancient skeleton attachment, and then banish this card. All right, well. She will just evade it. So, boom, that's done. Fighter uh, is just gonna mace it to death. 100%. Boom. Um, recharge the mace. And then the cleric. Uh, she's already got a 99% chance without even revealing this. <laughs> Alright, well. So that wasn't too terrible. Do we discard this um, to go again? I think we do. We are under the gun here. Holy symbol. Reveal this card to add two to your check to recharge your spell. That's the divine trait. Huh. Ah. Eh. I don't think it's something we'll keep in our deck, but it's cute. Um, and because it's divine, I can use it to heal, which isn't a terrible idea. All right. Let's look at something here. We've got three cards in that deck, 10 in this. So we have 13 cards. We only have 11 rounds. All right, whose turn is it? The. I think here we're gonna holy candle. I'm not, I don't need to keep this for any reason. So we're holy candle. Yes, six more turns. Nice. That was really good. Um, I think I'm gonna play Pelagian. This helps against, I might need it for a divine check. Let's explore first. A sneak, really? A sneak? All right, so before you ask, see the wisdom perception eight or discard a card. Yeah. All right, I could evade it, but Undefeated monsters other than villains or henchmen are banished, but I think if I evade it It still goes in because it's it's not considered defeated or undefeated I could beat this guy. He's a 10 though. All right 37% chance. I don't have anything to help with that. So Failure so I gotta discard something. I think I'm okay discarding the sages journal. We're not going to need it anyway. There's no henchmen as a villain, so we'll discard that. All right, boom. All right. Um, wow, I only have a 4% chance of success. Let's reveal the short bow. It jumps up to 88. Uh, I'm okay with that. I wonder, can I use her before the combat? No, I can't. All right. We'll just roll this out. Got him. I think I'm going to use her now. Recharger. I could go again. That, that actually might be a little bit better. Let's go again. Pit Trap. We'll use the Thieves Tools to get rid of that. And then I get to go again. Recharge the Thieves Tools. 75% chance. Got it. I wish I could find some masterwork thieves too. Those would be good. And we'll explore now. This has to be their last ally. Giant we Weasel. Wisdom Survival. Uh, if you fail the check to acquire this, bury a card. Ooh. All right. Uh, oh, no. We've got no blessings? No blessings. Wow. Well, that sucks. All right. I could evade this to give someone else a chance. And I think I'm going to do that because I think the other guys are better at, at it than me. So, we'll evade it. That goes right back into the deck. You, you stay there. Alright. This guy's wisdom is... Oh, shit. His is... This is a D4. So he's not good at getting that. So then 
instead, I think we're going to have him go over here. Why did I think the fighter's wisdom was good? It's his charisma that's good. All right, so we'll go... We'll go over there with the fighter. Even though it's not a great place for him, he can he can deal with it. Alright, let's explore here. Goblin dog. Alright, well we'll reveal the great club. 90% chance. Just go straight up. Clobber him. Uh when using a weapon switch wait, what? After you experience you may discard two cards to explore again. That's interesting, but I don't think we need to do that just yet, so we'll pass. Alright, this place is closed. We're gonna go to the waterfront. Alright. Now, I can do Isudi right now, but I don't think I'm gonna do that. We're gonna go ahead and explore. Oh, 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 oh. Alright. Need your help, guys. Need your help. Blessing of Gorum. Strength melee. Or just a blessing of the gods. If I do this, makes this. Uh, that's not good. Wait, stop. Play this. Makes a 95% chance. What is that? Blessing copied. Why am I not seeing what the blessing is? Okay, whatever. We are... What is this? Cancel. Cancel this. Alright. What the hell happened here? Current blessing is what? Nothing? How did I end up getting two dice? Was it because they both used it? Makes a 95% chance. And I think I want to do that. We, we want to we want the sure thing. We need to close this out. Close location, yes. Uh, recharge a card. Um, I guess we'll recharge the soldier. I'm just going to go ahead and freaking... Lightning touch him? Let's just acid arrow. Ooh, nuke him. It's the only way to be sure. Nuke him from orbit. Blam. Done. Recharge the acid arrow, because we may need it. And then that should be it. Alright, we close down this location. There we go. Cool. Uh, we would have to discard one. Um... Let's... Can we just play this? No, because there's no cards there. Um, well, I don't want to get rid of Augury, so probably the quarterstaff is the only thing I want to get rid of. Why does he have to discard? Why does he have to discard? Alright, well... I don't know why I was being for. Was that because the the waterfront was that a thing? I don't know. End of turn actions, nothing. Just draw cards. I say go. All right, here we go. Always forget that when we start our turn with somebody else, we can give a card to somebody. Um, but she has nothing she really wants to give. Um, this was wisdom check, right? But. We've got no... I really would like to acquire that card. Um, but if I fail this check... If I fail this check, the card goes away, and but we still get to try to close this place on each additional turns. But I, I still would like to try to get that card. And we have 14 turns. So, I think I'm actually going to do this. And hold on, who's... She's got eight cards in her discard pile. What do I have in my discard pile? Some blessings. We'll reveal this holy symbol. And then who I do I want to cure? Um... Me. 
We need the, uh... We need the blessings. Uh, I'm not gonna use the golem, so we'll just pass the turn. A detect evil is not helpful. Alright, we know... We know you searching here is nothing. But, just for shits and giggles, wisdom survival. That's what I just wanted to check again. But we can evade. And... Kind of game the system here. End our turn. Oh, I'm low on cards there. Um, you are gonna go over here. Wisdom survival. Is it's bad. He's he's has no chance at doing anything. So we're just gonna pass the turn. Didn't show anything great. All right, we gotta we gotta start closing this. We can't we can't screw around. As much as I'd like that card, um, I think it's time to just. What's his wisdom? It's only a D eight. All right, we can't we can't screw around. Fifty percent chance. And we got it. Look at that. Uh, attempt to close location. 37% chance. And we got it. Hey. Look at that. Look at that. Set point's a good place to be if you look past the frequent attacks and minimal tavern choices. I think it has character. Oh, who's this guy? Longiku Kaijutsu. Oh, is this the father of... Uh, uh, Amiko? You there! You can fool everyone else, but you can't fool me. Your antics against goblins endangered a lot of people. Next time, leave Sandpoint's defense to the city guard and other trained professionals. Half the guard was drunk on Festival of Wine when the goblins attacked. Not all warriors know which end of a blade to hold when they've had a few. Just what we need. Filthy vagrants to attract even more trouble to town. Father, that is enough. Treat my guests with respect or leave. No, daughter. It is time for you to leave this filthy hole and come home. Now, he tries to grab Omiko's hair. Oh, shit. He grab her, trying to grab her hair? She dodges the grab and brains Longiku with a ladle. Get out now. You are not welcome here. Amiko says it's time to go. If I have to ask you to leave, I it won't be so gentle. <laughs> I am leaving now. Amiko, you're as dead to me as your mother. Oh shit, that is fucked up. <sighs> Looks like I'll need a well cleaned ladle now, since Jackass's stew, uh, uh, since Jackass stew's not on the menu. Ah, oh, God, I read that totally wrong. Victor Lee! Okay, we have completed the scenario. We get some gold that we haven't spent. All right, that's fine. All right, we get... um. Oh, yeah, we get allies, right? So, let's see. Mauricio has met Chameleon. Bury this card to evade your counter. Discard this card to explore your location. Meh. It's not, not that useful. All right. A squire. Recharge this card. Tattoo D4 to your melee combat check. Uh, bury this card to reduce damage dealt to you by two. This guy is nice. This guy is quite nice. I like him. Useful for the fighter. All right. The wizard has met with Aldern Foxglove. We we saw him in a prior adventure. Banish this card to reduce damage dealt to you to a character at your location by three. Banish this card to succeed or your check to acquire a weapon, an arm, an item, or a spell. Um, useful, useful. Maybe keep him. Maybe not. And she has met a crow. Recharge this card to win the six to your check to acquire a weapon, an arm, or an item, or discard it to explore. Not super needed. All right, we're done with there, and I think it is time to reset our decks. So we'll be doing that off camera. So guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you soon.